new at six. Ramadan, the holy Islamic month, started this week. Muslims around the world, including in Sacramento, come together in a ritual of daily fasting. This year, with the Israel and Hamas conflict, Ramadan is more difficult as the community asks for a ceasefire. ABC 10's Candace Red has the story. It is a month that you reflect upon the blessing that you had. Indeed, all praise is due to Allah. We seek his guidance and his forgiveness. Muslims around the world are observing the holy month of Ramadan. Ramadan is this beautiful mixture of like cleansing your body, cleansing your soul. Ramadan is the ninth month in the Islamic lunar calendar. Us Muslims believe that the life of this world is, is a great test from God. Uh, and it's through that test that our true character shows. As for the guidance of success, for 30 days, Muslims fast from sunrise to sunset. Uh, by depriving the physical body of the distractions of food and water and the demands of modern life, one is able to achieve some type of honest self-appraisal to know who they are and where they stand in God's plan. Ramadan is also filled with prayer and charity. We also make the commitment to continue to speak up for oppressed people. I cannot not think of the others who are less fortunate around the world. And what can we do to help them out, especially the people in Palestine? Ramadan comes at a challenging time this year with the Israel-Hamas conflict in Gaza. Usually I decorate the house for Ramadan. We put on songs to celebrate Ramadan. According to the territory's health ministry, more than 30,000 Palestinians have been killed since the war started five months ago, most of them women and children. I have not really had the heart um, to decorate. And the thing that breaks my heart the most is for the people who lost loved ones. Ceasefire now, please, please. What would it take for us to say ceasefire now? In the shadow of war, Muslims are observing Ramadan with hopes for peace. There is no justice unless we have peace. Every human is entitled to live a happy, safe life.